Well, let's start by opening this very smooth case. It feels like the texture you would get in a really good drone. Let's start by opening the accessories. You have one extra battery, a screwdriver, and extra propellers. Now let's start opening the main part, the drone. The drone has brushless motors and foldable wings. It has 4K video quality and 30 FPS. Let's see more about the drone. These are the white LED lights at the bottom. There is a sensor at the bottom as well. The drone has a fan to cool down. These are the indicating LED lights. Insert class 10 memory card to get footage. Let's fold them back. Now always remember to fold the front wings first. Let's look at the controller. Unfold the hand rests at the bottom. Take out the antennas for GPS. Put two AA batteries inside the controller. Inside the zip, there will be a instruction manual. Even after watching this video, make sure to always read the manual first. Let's start setting things up for the indoor flight on the controller as well as the drone. I am going to be turning off GPS MO in this flight. Indoors can't reach GPS signal because of interference. Let's start flying. Turn on your phone and go to settings. Go to Wi-Fi and you will see the Holy Stone Wi-Fi momentarily. You must turn on the drone first. Waiting for connection. Get the Ophelia Go app to see the footage. Now, put your device on to the phone stand included. On the controller, pull up a gap that you will see above. The controller. Now that you have the app open and the Wi-Fi connected, enter device to see footage. If you are outside, turn on GPS. Put both joysticks down right, and now you will see blinking thing in the screen. Let's calibrate the drone. Turn the drone anyway three times full circles until blinking green. Now spin the drone three times again. Point the drone face up until solid green and red light. Now let's start flying. To start spinning propellers, press the lock button once. Now simply press. To take a button at top left of the remote control, here is the drone footage. And Joe. I don't prefer to fly drones indoor. GPS is not connected. Do not attempt. Don't do this like I did. Whenever this scenario happens, immediately. Long press the lock down to shut the drone down. As you see, I did some damage to the drone propellers, but everything else is fully functional and fine. See ya guys in the next video.